Hello, I'm Tom Cosgrove, a Professor of Civil Engineering at the University of Limerick. Mankind has harnessed energy from water mills and windmills. For millennia, civil engineers create electrical energy by releasing stored water. Wind energy can be stored by running the same system in reverse. Water for drinking is diverted, treated, and distributed in networks to the tap for families and communities. Towns and cities are linked by networks of roads, canals and railways, crossing great natural obstacles with bridges, viaducts and tunnels in the process. And in the cities themselves, an astonishing variety of structures are designed in conjunction with architects to accommodate the endless variety of activities that make up the life of any human community. Flood hazards are assessed, storm water is collected and redistributed to the natural environment in a controlled way. Waste products, including wastewater, are collected in networks and treated so they can be safely discharged to the natural environment. The civil engineer is centrally involved in the design and construction of harbours and airports that are the node points of global transport and trade networks. However, all of these structures and networks may impact on the surrounding environment. And so, the civil engineer uses mathematics and the sciences to assess and predict physical loads, to assure the safety and performance of new structures and networks, but also to understand and predict the impact of her work both during and after construction on human, animal and plant communities and physical heritage features in the surrounding environment. So, in meeting the needs of communities, a civil engineer works in multi-skilled professional teams and with local communities, harnessing natural forces, intervening sensitively in the natural environment and caring for it. Civil engineers, therefore, solve a wide variety of problems as they work imagine, design, build, manage and maintain the networks and infrastructure that make modern civilization possible.